Alright guys, this is Fusion Moth for Hawksmith Gaming. My new PC turned up today, which is a Scam 3XS Gamer 20A. I've upgraded from a current setup, which is this. And yeah, it looks a bit weird that it's a laptop, but it's a HP DV7 7332EA. It's got 16 gig of RAM, a 2.7 gigahertz quad core processor, and a gig graphics card, which is the letdown for it. As you can see here, it's only a 63. Oh uh, yeah, 635M, which is, isn't that great. And I have that set up with an external hard drive and my PVR. But now we've got a beast, and I've got, obviously, my monitor and everything ready. Uh, I've already broken the cell tip on it, just so I can open it up, but I've not actually looked at what's inside the box yet. So here goes. Alright, it's a big old box, mind. Massive box. Alright, so we have enough... Uh, Bubble wrap and packaging to make sure it's nice and safe, which is always good. Get rid of some of this. And by the way, this is recorded on my phone, so it's not going to be the best for sound quality. So. <laughs> okay, so there's all the bits inside. I don't really know what is in here. So first things first, I'm guessing this is going to be receipts and everything. Oops. If you want to look at this computer, it's the 20A, although I have upgraded it from what the um, default build is on the website. The default build has a 1TB hard drive, whereas I've upgraded to 2TB. Yeah, it's all my receipts and paperwork. It's cool. Um, I've really just tuned it up to make it perfect for me. So this is the motherboard. Yeah, it's just the packaging for motherboard. So we've got some connector cables, discs. That is my old RAM sticks, I'm guessing. I upgraded the RAM sticks, by the way. Some more connecty bits, my power plug, and some other bits and bobs, but we'll get rid of that. In here, I wonder what could be in this. Oh, let's open it and find out. Okay, so we are back. This little packet actually had my mug in it. Scam gives you a free mug whenever you purchase a free drop down. So I've got a Pac-Man one. Yay! Woohoo! So that'll be pretty funky. That'll be my new uh, tea mug when I'm gaming. And then we've got the beast in here. I don't know how I'm going to get this out. Um, again, I'll be back in a minute because I am recording this on my phone, so it is one handed operation at the moment, but I'll be back in a second. Okay, so that's that out of the packaging. I'm guessing it's going to have the whole system inside, but let's have a look at the outside first. Showing the USB port, some bits about it USB 3 and USB 2. Uh, it actually has 13 hard drive slots, which is uh, mental, to be fair. Don't really understand why you'd want so many, but this you know, is always upgradable. And bits about fans, expansion slots, and then little spec bits. And that is the case. Now I've gone for a black one with white trim. I was actually going to go for this one, which is the white one, but uh, I'm trying not to in case of dust. And also, dust will make it look silly. And there's the rest of the box. Now, what it says on top, I do not post this one yet. Kiss filled with anti static bubble wrap, blah 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 blah. Please see your all packages carefully removed. Da, 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 da. Free from dust, away from dust sunlight. La 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 la. Excellent. Yeah, I read on the delivery notes that they uh, fill it with bubble wrap, obviously, to make sure it's perfectly fine. Which I'm cool with. Yeah, it's good of them, because I'm guessing most places will just. So, you know, just sod it, send it as it is. But I was really impressed with Scan's service. They have a live tracker where it gives you constant updates on what's happening with your build. I think it's just a nice little touch. You keep, up, keep up to date with it. Just make sure all these are gone. Now that will open up. No, a bit of manhandling. There we go. 
go. And I come back. There it is. Right. Again, I'll just cut back when I've got this out, and then you can see what it's like. Back in a minute. So here it is, out of the box. I'll give you a quick run through. So these switches here, power, and I think that must be a reset or something similar. Here then you've got your headphones, microphone, the USB 2 port, USB 3 port, and this here then is a fan switch controller. So you can turn the fans on high power and low power. It's a very cool looking case, I must admit. Let's go to the side, just plain black, and then go to the back of it. See all the little bits and bobs there, so you got some other stuff, some more USB 3s, some more USB 2s. Uh, you've got BIOS flashback, you've got left side, right side, subs, your mics in, lines in and out, some eSATAs, and then you've obviously got your hard drives and whatnot down there, and then USB cable. I don't know where that's going to, I haven't looked yet. But on the side, I've already opened it up, as you can tell, all the pink bubble wrap is out to show you inside of the device. So here then you've got your hard drive slots. It's very cool. And then you've got your motherboard, your fans. You've got two fans here. A nice big white one. Now I believe that white one has actually got some uh, lights around it, which is pretty cool. And then down here you've got your Corsair um, stuff. I don't know what stuff this stuff is. I don't build computers. But it is very cool. Very, very cool. Uh, my gold RAM sticks, which I upgraded to. That's pretty cool. The default was black, and I was like, nah, it's something cooler than that. So I got gold. Obviously, it's, I highly doubt it's going to make much of a difference with heat. So I thought, let's go for the coolest ones possible. So yeah, there's the system. I'll put it all back together, set it up, and then come back to the video. Back in a moment. There you go, and that's that all set up. Monitor, keyboard, and computer down there which sticks out one heck of a lot because it's really wide. But yeah, that's it guys. Thanks for watching. See you next video. Ta-da.